One Owner Car Guy, OneOwnerCarGuy.com. If you watch my channel much, you've probably seen the preview of the state surplus auction. And I bought a lot of stuff there. This is the video of us going over to get the stuff. You can see behind me here, I got all kinds of stuff. There's a pallet and detergent, soap, and more face masks and desks than you can count. And I'm going to go through everything and show you a lot of the stuff we got. What are you doing, Vlad? But basically, this is going to be the video of us going over and getting it, loading up the truck, bringing stuff back. It's a wishy-washy thing of this and that. I have Google Glass now, but I don't know much about the Android development kit thing, so I can't get them to do anything. They take a video, but I can't get it off of them. So if anybody knows about the Android development crap, let me know. That's about it. There's all kinds of cars out here. Awesome stuff. Anything you need, give me a call. Let me know. One on the car guy to car. Make sure to subscribe. Here we go. Middle of nowhere, Montana. And I'm in Garrison Junction waiting for my dad to where I can shoot up the hill and go pick up my stuff from the auction. It's going to be a long day. Showed up to pick up the U-Haul. The U-Haul hood's up. I don't know what's going on. Just picked up the U-Haul. We're going to be getting all the stuff from the auction. And I wanted to do a light walk around to the truck and show, for my own purpose, that this is all dented. Look, it's not on there. It's there. It's this. There's this. There's miscellaneous scrapes and dings everywhere. There's this. I'm at the place where I picked it up. And just a quick walk around to make sure. You see, they didn't put a sticker on that. Well, they did, right there. You help put the sticker on any damage to where you're able to, they know that you did it or didn't do it. The hood was up on this thing when we came up. So it's a little worrisome. Pink in the bumper, they got a sticker on it. And ding there. This side's dented in right here, but there's no sticker. Yeah, there is, there's one right there. Stickers here, stickers there, stickers everywhere. You're not gonna fool me and get me to take your damage. Okay, I gotta figure out where I'm going and we'll be right with you. In the G30 van, 1995, only 87,000 miles, and talk about government waste. They sold to me with a full tank of freaking gas. Even if I sold this to a customer, I'd be taking all the gas out of it and siphoning it out and putting it in something else. This is a bad to the bone van. It's gonna be bad to the bone for sale soon. That's the deal. Thanks for watching, I'll throw it in somewhere. Happy about the van. Look at the rubber, look at the rubber. The Trojan man should hear about this car, there's so much rubber on it. All right, somehow or another, we didn't bring the right binders or straps. So, in not having the right straps, we had to go to Harbor Freight, get some chains. We've got it on here. Glad's helping, got the van. U-Haul's ready to get loaded. I gotta get in there. Why are you working hard? Wow. Well, somehow or another, we got this thing strapped up. We'll see what happens here. We got chains on it. Change on the ground. Push. Pull. Push. Pull. Push. Pull. Grandpa needs help. Push. Push. Push this way. Houston, we have a problem. I did not expect them pumps to be there. Atomically correct dummies are here. Complete with pretty much everything from the look of it. Good! Wire, you Well, here it is. Here's the van. It's pretty. The van's nice. Lots of stuff here. Happy to be done. I'm tired. The kids are out there playing in the park. Going to get food. One owner car guy, and look at that van. G30 Sport Bag. G30 Sport Van. Kind of rare in the 30. Whatever, here's the hotel hall. It's full to the back. We just had a taco. I'm beat. Me and a couple guys loaded this thing up. I'm so glad they were helping out like they did because it's a lot of junk. There'll be more videos coming up. I'm pulling about the biggest hill you could. Beautiful views. And this thing, even when you downshift, it's not, there's all the way down. 
it's very quiet inside. Listen to the radio, whatever. It's definitely not, and I'm boots to the metal, man, going up this hill. This is um, an 8% grade. An 8% grade is very few and far between. But look at that view, man. Just gorgeous. Beautiful G30 in the mirror. Fantastic 97 F350. Last year, the square body. I don't remember what they call these. Nice truck, though. Yeah, buddy. Nice truck. Good excursion. Clean burning coal right from the heart of Montana, buddy. Going to provide power for all your electric cars and everything. Where everybody can complain and bitch and squall and moan about coal. Look at all that beautiful coal. It is. It's a beautiful sight. There's three engines at the front. There's three engines in the middle. Four. Holy smokes. There's a lot of engines. They are just rolling down the line, buddy. Three. Look at that clean burning coal. Woo, buddy. There was probably about 30 cars, 40 cars before I get my camera whooped on. So it is an absolutely gorgeous day. As you can tell, it's becoming fall, and that's that. I mean, just clipping some more in of this beautiful, clean, burning coal. It sure is just absolutely beautiful up here. These new ones have a unique feature that when you touch the brakes, and you're going down a grade, it'll downshift the transmission. That kind of engine. Right here. Pretty cool. Pretty stinking cool. And we put your gas back on a bit, it just starts, it'll go back down. Well, there's the off ramp. We're in Drummond. This is my ranch house, the um, U Haul here, and van's running good. House is still standing. Got more houses there. Need to rent this stuff out at some point, but I don't really care. Okay, so as you see, there is a lot of stuff that we got picked up. I got lots of details coming up, like you see. We're working on the Camry there. Also, we'll have the Explorer coming up. And this thing we picked up, man. It's a short bed. I already bought paint to do the bumper. It's a short bed F-250 heavy duty. 100,000 miles. It's got the different axle for the heavy duty stuff. And the seat. This thing is gorgeous. Look at the floor. This is nice. It's going to clean up so nicely. That's all I got to say. And then we got the Dodge and that. There's actually one, two, three, four. The Excursion 5 pickups coming up. The one ton van. Impala just got done. And if you remember, this Toyota was the other $200, $225, $275 dollars car. No, this one was $175, I think. And it's actually polishing up very nice. These areas, of course, are not that kind of clean, but they'll look good when it's washed. Fender, of course, that ain't gonna look much better. But look down the side here. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. Looking good, it's looking good. And this, oh my God. Wait till you see this, this just came in. Okay, thanks for watching. Keep in touch, subscribe if you're not. Like the video, it really helps out. And there'll be daily videos coming and going and lots of them up here. We'll talk to you.